Are you try to are you gonna try to get? Oh. <laughs> I'm trying to break the ice between eyes. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that's good. That's good. First of all, I I'm sincerely sorry I was late today. I had to get some tea for myself because I'm having like a sore throat today. Um, it's not COVID nineteen. Okay, I can smell. I can taste. Everything's good. I've just been speaking a lot. That's why I'm having it kind of like. A sore throat. <laughs> so, anyways, hello. My name is Jenny. What's your name? Hello, Jenny. Very nice to meet you. Ho um, hopefully, your voice is gonna be awesome in this conversation. Thank you. And uh, thankfully, I was able to to break this ice, and so I think now we can have this proper conversation. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. I like that. Oh, oh, it's, a, it's a really hard ice to break, you know. <laughs> but I, get it. I love your idiomatic expression. I love it. My my name is Joe Wilson, and I am from Brazil. Nice to meet you, Joe. Um, I know a lot of students from Brazil. Where in Brazil are you from, Joe? Um, I'm located in the northeast area. Ah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So what about you? You live in you live in America or you live in which part of the country are you located? Which part of the world? <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm sorry, well, the world, not the country. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. I understand. Well, basically, Joe, I'm a Filipino American. I, well, I grew up in the United States, but right now I'm staying in the Philippines. Have you heard about That's Philippines cool. by any chance? Yeah, for sure, for sure. I know. I mean, I don't have, I don't know, like a lot of things about the Philippines, but I know a little bit about the Philippines. <laughs> That's wonderful. But you know what, please. Joe? You look like a DJ. DJ Joe. Don't, don't ask me any questions about Philippines. <laughs> <laughs> I won't. Don't you worry. <laughs> you, you you mentioned that I, I look like a DJ. Oh my gosh! You are you are actually way off the mark. I'm not a DJ. I am actually a YouTuber. <laughs> You're a YouTuber? Oh wow! That's amazing. Well, oh, what are your <laughs> contents on your YouTube channel, I, Joe? I I think that I I am a YouTuber wannabe. <laughs> I actually I just uh, share my classes here on Cambly, you know, on YouTube, so that I can like show um, people that like are willing to learn English how you know look like having a conversation with a native speaker. So that's Aww. my idea. Oh, no. What's your YouTube channel? So am I on YouTube right now? Hello, YouTube. So the name of my channel is JD English. It is like the, the same name here on Facebook. Username. Yeah. Ah, uh, I'm going to take a look at that. <laughs> so, so Joe, I have a question for you. Why have you decided to kind of like, kind of like document your Cambly classes and kind of like post it on, on YouTube? Well, it was like my friend that encouraged me, you know, um, actually, um, I like came across with Campbell last year when I was, you know, stuck at home because of the pandemic and I started watch some videos on YouTube and out of the blue, this came Cambly advertisement popped up on my screen. So I took a look. I saw <laughs> I saw my fellow Brazilian at the time taking a class um, here on Cambly, and uh, later on we we like we um, 
became friends. And um, when I shared my class uh, to him, like privately, um, he, he said me that I should um, share my classes on YouTube because uh, in his opinion, I was good, you know, at talking. <laughs> Uh, here with native speaker because and he said there was like this um, energetic guy talkative and this is good for you too in my class it was like a little bit entertaining so that's why i decided you know to to give it a try and since then i've been sharing my adventures you know to people uh, know how crazy or bad or good i am when it's coming to speak in English. <laughs> okay. Oh, that's wonderful. You know what? Mm -hmm. You can be a very good inspiration, Ash. Really? You think so? Oh, I I'm, think I'm so. so flattered. I'm so flattered uh -huh. right now. Hearts for you. <laughs> Thank you. Well, you know why, Joe? I have a lot of students here on Cambly that are from Brazil, all over Brazil. I just could not remember the exact name or state in Brazil, but I got a lot of students. And sometimes they would tell me like, hey, Jenny, I feel like my English is slowly improving. And like, I feel like I want to give up. And I feel like other people are way excellent than me as far as improving their English and being on the top of the game. And sometimes it's really nice to see other people that has the same ethnicity as you. Like for you example, you can be a great example for my uh, students from Brazil because you see you're a Brazilian, but you can talk English very well. So you can be their inspiration too to not give up with their dreams because mm -hmm. their English I mean, them learning English, Joe, is not just about personal development or something like that. But they're doing that because of their job and because of their own businesses as well. So you can yeah. just really see the need of them learning English. So, mm -hmm. yeah, continue to be an inspiration, Joe. I hope your YouTube channel will become bigger and bigger. So you inspire and encourage other people at the same time, especially Brazilians. Hopefully, we're going to like make this partnership. You're going to help me to help them. <laughs> Why not? We're ready here. All of the tutors on Cambly, we're ready. Let's go. <laughs> so uh, today I want to play a game with you. Do you. Are you good at charades? Charades? Oh my goodness. Well... I must admit with you, I'm not good with that, but you know what? I'll take it as a challenge. Let's go. It is for, <laughs> it is for educational purpose, you know, because my charade involves a little bit of American idiom. So uh, hopefully you're going to be able to figure them out, right? <laughs> Why not? Uh, you mentioned the, the um, category for today are idiomatic expressions. Yeah, you know, uh, uh, my fir my first actually sentence was like breaking the ice. So <laughs> I kind of gave you that. gave you a hint. So here it is my first charade. Don't be scared because I'm going to show you a. <laughs> so what is this? Backstab? What? Come on, you are better than that. <laughs> <laughs> so okay, that's not okay. it? I'm not gonna stab myself because, you know, I love my life, but <laughs> think about <laughs> it. <laughs> Please don't. Please don't. Okay, so what are you trying to say? You can, you, you can express more, not just actions, Joe. So... Uh huh. So it is like stab in the back. <laughs> stab in the back. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Backstab or stab in the back for sure. <laughs> oh, um, uh, the next one is pretty easy. Okay. Okay, hold on. We have, we have it here. Ooh, monkey! I see a monkey. Right. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> okay. 
Do it one more time? Mm. <laughs> Easy peasy. To monkey around. <laughs> monkey see, monkey do. Exactly. Monkey see, monkey do. <laughs> monkey see, monkey do. <laughs> That's a good expression. That's a good expression. Yeah. And now I, I have another one. This one is pretty, pretty easy, so I think you're gonna be able to identify it. So here I have a bag, and then I am like, this is a cat, a fake cat. <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay, okay. So you get a cat, and you get a bag. Yeah, and the cat is inside the bag, so I am. Ah, uh, pulling the cat out. Let the cat out of the bag. Let the cat, yeah. <laughs> you are good, girl. <laughs> it's like you're describing something. So, pretty easy. I'm, I'm like literally acting out the American's idioms. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. The next one, I think this is not really common in America. But let me see if you can guess it. Here yeah. I, have, I have a key. Uh huh. Uh huh. Drop the key. No. Key okay, down. Wait. Huh? <laughs> key? key down. Key down. Have you uh, ever heard about this? Um, I did. I did hear about that most definitely. But it's um, it's a phrasal verb key down yeah to come, down, relax. to come down to relax and the last one i mean do a gum and wait a minute <laughs> because it is really important to what i'm gonna do here right now <laughs> oh my gosh hopefully i'm gonna be able to do that i can't <laughs> Supposed, I supposed to make a bubble. Ah, that game got out to talk. <laughs> so, are you, are you, are you try to, are you gonna try to guess? <laughs> On the bubble? <laughs> <laughs> You're so funny, <laughs> You're so funny Jeff. You're not so funny, I think you know. on the bubble. On the bubble? Burst your bubble. Ah, burst your bubble. <laughs> there's, there's also an idiomatic expression that is called on the bubble. So you're trying to burst the bubble. Thanks for trying. <laughs> Thanks for trying, Joe. <laughs> but Joe, yeah. But I need that you fail. <laughs> oh, no, it's fine. It's fine. Thank you for your time today. It was a great game we had today. I'm going to check your channel. Thanks a lot. It was a great game we had today. Thank you, Jenny. Thank you so much. Hopefully, we're gonna be able to talk next time. And, yeah, uh, yeah. Feel free. It was a real, really, really pleasure meeting you. Hope you have an amazing day here in Brazil. It is night. And, yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah. But uh, I'm so. I'm not gonna hit the <laughs> back right now because I'm gonna watch some Netflix. So <laughs> thank you so much oh. again. You're welcome, Joe, and please enjoy your night. Take good care. I'll see you again soon. Peace bye, out. Joe. Bye, bye.